Alright, Price the Right fans, now time for episode B for Wednesday, September 30th, 2009. And the pricing games that were in the second episode for today were the following. Half off, squeeze play, any number, one wrong price. Then we had pass the buck, and last but not least, switch. In half off, Patrick had a 1 in 8 chance of winning $10,000. He believed the 10 grand was in box number 9. When he opened the box, he discovered he found nothing. Box number 15 had the 10 grand. In sweet play, Sarah played for an outdoor kitchen island. She took out the first 9 instead of the 2 or the second nine to make the price seven thousand two ninety five. Ah, uh, she should have taken out the two with seven thousand nine ninety five. And I have seen that outdoor kitchen before, so I knew she did not have the price right. Sorry, Sarah. In any number, Erlene picked the seven first after finding out the first number of the price of the car was the one. The seven went to the iPod. She then picked the number 9, that went to the iPod. She then chose number 6, that went to, can you believe it, the iPod. So she won $796 worth of iPod. At least she didn't get the piggy bank, that was the good news. $18,324 was the price of the Chevy Cobalt. Barbara played one wrong price. She believed that the one wrong price was a designer handbag and not the riding lawnmower priced at $14.50 or the dinette which I really don't remember the price of but the good news was the handbags were not $2,800 they were $3,495 that was indeed the one wrong price good job Barbara Leanne played past the buck 